Hello and welcome back. The CTR. As you can see, we've actually got all the decals now. So it's just down to the heckin' stickers. I'm hopeful that these gold tier stickers can be taken care of for the most part today. Because, uh, 3,000 is hard to do every day. Like during the weekday. And I'd still like to get one thing every day. There's 9,000. Oh, heck, there's not even 9,000. Heck. There's 15,000. Hey, Real, how are you doing today? I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. 15,000 points for all the gold tier stickers is insane. But soon, we'll have all the things. I know we will. Also, just 13 more wins for this guy. It'll be great. Real, you got here immediately. I want pre sort playground. Still my favorite out of all the event tracks. That's just me though. I think we played as emotional Daisy yesterday, didn't we? I'm sorry, real. I'm doing all right, and I hope things get better. And remember, if you ever need to talk about anything, I'm here. Not saying you have to, it's just if you're if and when you're ready. Cause you don't have to deal with all that stuff on your own. <laughs> Gotta exit out of exit out of something. I'll get the words out one day. Do you feel comfortable with me and the people in chat? I'm glad to hear that. Oh. I'm currently just trying to pop my back, my shoulders. I've had a very, very lazy day today. No problem. We all need to be able to get things off our chest. On our own time. I'm not going to sit here and rush you into anything. Just make sure you're ready to talk to somebody. You should talk to somebody. Eek. Oh heck. Come on. We keep flipping back and forth and I'm scared. There's some lag going on here. Oh wait, oh, okay. Real, I'm sorry about that. I am so used to people in front of me actually being behind me, people And uh, behind me, whatever, being in front of me. And I was like, I'll just throw this. It'll hit the, the box. Real might be actually be behind me. So that was my bad. Come on. I will say, I did play a trap somewhere. In a very obvious place to put a trap, but it's probably gonna hack me up more than anything. I have a feeling it will. Eek. 
Yeah, when I hit that bowling bomb, my main intention was like to hit the box in front of me and get another item. Kill one. Because that didn't hack me up at all. I did a lot better than I usually do on the track, online at least. Ooh, I'm surprised I actually kept it. Hey Tina, how are you doing today? I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. Wait. Why is real? Why are you in? Oh, okay, never mind. I thought you were next place for a second there. Cause it had your name on eighth place, and it like flipped you all the way up to eight. No, oh, second, sorry. That was not a perfect race for me. I actually messed up on the first lap. The first lap, I lost my speed at one point. But other than that, it was really good. I'm doing alright. Yeah, I messed up once. It was... on the spiral, I believe, at the very end of the track. That was the only time I messed up, I think. Other than that, I did really well. But again, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to actually hit you there. I was honestly just trying to get rid of that bomb. You always want the right corners of those bumps. I do occasionally. Hot Air Skyway, of course. I honestly think we're getting two of the sticker packs today. Hi, Queen! How are you doing today? It doesn't even feel like Saturday. Because I'm used to watching your streams on Saturday. <laughs> I'm not gonna hide that. I don't know why I said said like that, but yeah. I'm so used to watching your streams on Saturday that it didn't feel like Saturday. Something felt off. But I've had a very lazy day. You need to do more than exist because you're a wonderful bean. Everybody here is a wonderful bean. Y'all make life so much better. Y'all really do. Things need to not feel off. Things got to be good for some people. And I'd like it if things were better for all of you. Okay, thanks. Please. <laughs> you know, I know it's not going to work magically, but still, please. You think it's just that time of year? What is... What has been going on these past few months? Things have just been really weird. Also, on to a completely different topic for a split second. I still love this track, but I still do not know how to keep Ultra Second Fire around that loop at the bottom. Or at the, uh, Beginning of the track. Hello, Slash Tomato. How are you doing today? Oh, heck, I hit the little bump. It would be nice if things could magically be better. 
I really wish that were the case. For all of us. Eeh. I know. We talked about this before. Queen, but I think the next event will probably be the uh, 12th for this. Like, I know you probably got other stuff on your mind right now, but still. Like, you did ask me about this, and I don't remember if I actually said the date, but I think it's going to be on the 12th. Also, I don't think Reel's messed up on this track at all. Ugh. Guess the game again, you're owning these noobs. I can't believe you're owning these noobs, Tomato. Wait, if you got it again, where'd you get it at? E. With this game, you just want Baby T? Ah. Uh, Baby T is pretty good. Baby T is literally the best tracer in the game. Even though I'm literally just playing as a chicken with a crown on his head right now. I'm playing as the king chicken. Brand new original character to the craft series. Just a random chicken with a crown on its head. Don't worry about it. Eee. Whew. Got a perfect game? I thought so. Oh, I'm not going to finish this race. Oh, heck. I could have finished it if I didn't hit the wall. I still need to try Titanfall. Queen, I love you too. You're also a gym, you heck. You're all wonderful and amazing. And I'm glad that y'all even want to spend any time here. But seriously. You all do make it everything better. So thank you. Time to get noms. If I watch more Criminal Minds. I hope the noms are good. <laughs> we love you too. I can do polar bass. Brother rebought the game so you borrowed it from him. But is it on a different platform than PlayStation? Because I think you play on PlayStation, don't you? Like, is it on the Switch or the Xbox? You enjoyed playing it till 5 a.m. last night? That's heckin' late. I was about to say I don't remember the last time I stayed up that late, but I do remember the last time I stayed up that late. It wasn't that long ago, it was like a few months ago. I'll do that again if I want to. I want to if I need to. Just heck. It's been a, it has been a little while. I wouldn't mind doing that again. I don't know when that happened and you couldn't sleep. I'm sorry, Tina. That happens sometimes though. PS4. Ah. I still need to get a PS4. I still need to pick this stuff on the Switch and PS4 too. Cause I'm a heck and I'm just gonna play it everywhere. I will say, even though I only play the Xbox version on stream, I'd probably play the PS4 and Switch versions whenever. Since they're not part of the stream. 
in a permanent fashion like this is. Jeez, really, I just saw you fly. Come on. That one was just me firing. I didn't actually expect it to hit you. I feel like you're going to be very upset at me soon enough. If you are, I'm sorry. I'm just like firing these things off whenever I get them, for the most part. Because I do want to get things like shields. Come on, there we go. Oh, I lost it. Are you used to it? That's not a good thing to be used to, though. To be fair, I know that experience. Well, I know that life because I used to be like used to that too. But thankfully, recently, for whatever reason, I've been getting tired earlier and just getting to sleep easier. Because I'm an old man. I don't know if that's actually the reason. I'm not that old, but still. I want to keep saying it. Because I'm a heck. Come on. Oh, I thought I could keep it. Lucky, why would you do this to me, baby girl? Ooh. There we go. Whew. I am surprised that the Megumi player messed up as bad as they did. They gave me the win. Um, that didn't even look like it hit him. Whew. You're getting old, sadly. When you get older, your body gets more tired. Well, I mean, we're all getting older. Every second of every day, we're getting older. You fell asleep at 9 and woke up at 11.30? That's not enough sleep. It's not enough sleep at all. Mole Man. I see Mole Man when I first thought I saw the Mole Man. I haven't seen that in forever. You honestly thought it was the Megumi that hit me? No, it was me. I just fired it for the sake of firing it. And after I fired it, I was like, is real gonna get hit? And I was like, nah, real will jump over it. Because the little ramps. But it happened to go to you right whenever you hit the ground, I think. But yeah, he originally just fired it for the heck of it. You've been having gray hair since you were 14? You've been an old man? Heck. I don't remember whenever I started getting white hair, but I had white hair in, uh... High school, not like full on like white hair, but like random strands. And occasionally, I'll see like a random white hair and it's like, oh, there it is. See you trying to hide. You're fine, Tina, just you gotta try to get more sleeps. You're still glad she messed up to make me win? Just pretend she hit you? I mean... If you want to, but it was me. Oh heck, I didn't do the thing. Or did I? I didn't. I'm not gonna worry about it since I didn't do it. It's fine. I'm a forgetful bean. It's fine. 
It comes with being an old man. Come here, Lucky. Lucky, are you going to lay in my lap or are you going to jump up and hit me in the face like you have in the past? Not like I actually smack me, but she would jump up to get over my lap. And her back would like bop my chin. Probably still try to take better care of yourself. It's just hard. It can be sometimes. But yeah, I gotta work on ourselves. Ow. I felt that claw. Thankfully she doesn't like really dig into me. And if I say ow, she usually uh, loosens her grip. Jeez, real? Did you just flatten that poor guy? Burger? I can't catch up. You're going too fast, it's time to slow down. Eat some grass. Grass extends your life by three months. I don't know about that now. That just seems like a bad idea. Come on. Whew. I believe, unless something really bad happens here, that Real has this race locked down. Just put mittens on the cat. I don't know if that'd be a good idea either. I feel like. Lucky's a very smart cat. I feel like she would figure out a way to get them off and then she would make sure to, that I would never want to put them on her again. I feel like Luna would be scared to death. Cookie would just be like, whatever. But Lucky would pop my demise. I'm lucky that I'm on the good side. That wasn't an intentional pun. It just kind of came out like that. But it's fine. Everything is much <laughs> Little mittens on the cat. <gasps> now she's laying down. She's good. She'll lay here for the next five minutes or for the rest of the stream. I'm not sure which one yet. I just know that's how it's going to be. Also, I still can't believe we're actually done with all the decals, done with all the carts, all the tires, all the paint jobs. All we have left are the stickers and the gold here skin. Well, unlockable skins too, in general. We'll probably get the unlockable skins last, honestly. Blizzard Bluff, ooh. Wouldn't mind playing on that. Oh. Lucky? What are you doing? She's like rolled over on her back. You miss fear too? I'm sorry. We beat the entirety of the DLC on the hardest difficulty. And I went back and got all the achievements for the DLC. So next time we play it, we just have to beat it on the hardest difficulty, flip some tables, and blow up a couple times. 
I think that's literally all we have left for Peter 2 besides multiplayer, but... Unless we could get a group of people for multiplayer, we won't be able to show that off. I would love to be able to show off all that stuff, though. But yeah. Fear 2 was close to being completely done. Well, it's done as we can do for now. I will say, though. Next year, we'll finish up Fear. In general, we'll have Fear 3. That should be fun. It'll be a different experience. It's not really a horror game. But we can maybe make something work with it. I, I don't know why I said that. Like, maybe I can spook y'all or something. I don't know. Don't, don't mind me. Kill him. Oh my gosh! You have th Fear 3 for Xbox co op? Hmm. Maybe, we'll see. Also, I screwed up so bad. I wasn't paying attention, I thought I was drifting, and I was not drifting up to the thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and use this. It'll be fine. Come on. <gasps> what happened? Oh, what happened? I am getting hacked up by this level. <gasps> no! 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 Hack man, you hack! What's the Pac-Man crossover? No! 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 I think Lucky's just like, okay, I'm tired of you yelling. I'm leaving. Oh, I got flattened? Heck. Dang it. Dang it. No! Why me? Why me? Whew. Okay, I got hacked up real bad. I will say, there probably will be co-op Fear 3, but I don't know exactly who I want to ask to do that with me. Because I'm a shy bean, I'm probably going to ask people that I play a lot with and spend a lot of time with. Like outside of stream. Just because... I mentioned this to somebody else recently. I get really nervous when I'm talking to people like voice to voice for the first time. Like I get super heckin' nervous. There's only been a few times where I haven't done it and it usually deals with people that I watch on stream that I know also watch me. And then we just kind of like, it just works, I guess. Because I don't freak out or anything. But, uh, yeah. There's that. I will say, I know who I want and who I... I, well, I know who I want to play it with. But I don't see it happening anymore. You used to be nervous and insecure about your voice because most people think you sound like a boy because your voice is so deep. But now you're fine with voice chatting with people? Really? That's nice. I don't really get sweaty or start to stutter. I just get really quiet. And that'd probably be a bad thing. 
when they're on the stream, they just like not talk and be like, mm. You'll still get quiet when no one else talks. I'll be quiet when people do talk and I'll be like, alright, I'm just gonna let them talk. It'll be fine. I'm still nervous and shy being. But it's not as bad as it used to be. At least I'd hope to say it's not as bad as it used to be. Because you can't think of topics. You see, for me, it was always like, I don't want to bother said person so I'm like they're probably here for somebody else not me and I guess that's why streaming has been easier because I'm like people have to come here to see the streams maybe they want to talk to me and that turned to okay they're coming here consistently they have to enjoy my company right and now it's just like I don't mind. I'm just gonna do what I want to do on stream. Cause heck. Eee. Burger. Oh no! I knew I was gonna get it. No! Oh, jeez. And yes, I tried to throw a potion at you. I missed terribly, but I did try to hit you with it. Because I was like, I don't want to lose. Ah, heck, come on. To be fair, if I gotta lose, I'd rather be somebody I'm playing with. Then the randoms in the lobby. Come on. Not again. Whew. There we go. Do that too. Especially in large groups. You hate being in large groups if you talk in small groups. I. I got a lot better at it, especially whenever I started playing Destiny with people. Because in the groups that we played with, there were two people that were always the leaders. Ivalov and Aizen. If they weren't around, even if we had a bunch of randoms with us, everybody turned to me. Or either, either everybody turned to me or I did it because nobody else was talking. I just said heck it and went for it, I think. Either way, people would start to look at me and be like, Alright, you're leading this team. Tell us what to do. Tell us what you want us to do and we'll do it. You joined a Twitch stream, uh, Twitch stream once and everyone was like, I don't think I, didn't think I sound like that. I speak different than the way I type. He's a lot of southern slang when you speak, really. Well, if one day in the future, if you could do voice chat with anyone here, you'd make sure to make everyone as comfortable as you could. I mean, that's a good thing to do. I think we should do Crash Cove. <laughs> I feel like Real would be upset with me. I want to go with Prehistoric Playground. I actually thought about going random and to see what it would give us. Don't you dare. Don't you dare vote for Trash Cove. And I'm sitting over here like, but I like it. I like all the tracks. Chester Cheez-It. I didn't re realize that name was in here. I haven't had Cheez-Its in forever. I don't even think I've had Cheez-Its since I was in school. Trash 
Cove is Trash Cove. But Crash Cove is a nice track. Seriously, I do enjoy it. I do enjoy every single track in the game. Lucky. You can come around this way. You want to jump across? You want to jump? There you go. General Bloodhawk, sir, I bet your service. I. Here's the thing. Oh, geez, what's happening? Here's the thing. Every time that I led, I was like, I don't know if I was a good leader, and everybody was like, you were actually really good. And I. I said that a few times where I was like, I still don't feel like a good leader, even though I've done it a few times. And they're like, you probably don't feel that way because you are, and it's like, excuse me? How could you? Also, I'm just gonna do this. I've done this once before, and it's been a while since I've done this. But I want to do this again. So. Come on. But yeah, I've been told that I did alright. I've been told that I was better than I gave myself credit for, which has been for a lot of things. And with how often that's actually been said, it's kind of opened my eyes a little bit. Which I know some people, if they were here, they would be super excited to hear that. Because for the longest time, I always would fight things like that. But, I don't know, like enough, like so many people have said it in the past, it's like... They can't be lying to me, could they? Oof. I'm not going back for that one. I got hacked up there. I had such a good, like, prehistoric playground earlier today. But things happen. Rude. I will say, I guess we'll find out in the future, because I still do plan on doing all of D1, but I still don't know when that's actually going to happen. And if we do all of D1, then I'm going to have to be a leader on stream. And so it'll either be confirmed good leader or confirmed not so good leader. But either way, I'm ready to get back into that. I just don't know when it'll happen. It could be very soon, but most likely it'll be sometime next year when we get back to it. Eesh. I am going to at least get fifth, maybe even fourth. Nope. No. Real? Did you have a perfect lap or a perfect race? But early on, you got to be over your your selling in the. It's like that's not cool said to the guy you should be careful what you say to people because you don't know what a person is going through exactly you never know what somebody's going through could always be nice to others because I mean I don't know about you guys but knowing that he put a smile on his face is like one of the best feelings in the world And I couldn't imagine doing something or saying something that can make somebody upset intentionally. Wow. 
turbo track. I'm not good at turbo track, but let's do it. Yeah, it costs nothing to be nice to somebody. Nothing at all. But not everybody is nice to everybody else, which is a shame. Also, I think I brought this up before. Actually, I'm not going to do that because I feel like that's full of something. <laughs> so I'm sorry about that. I don't even know when that'll happen. You're going to make people feel happy and help with their problems? But you can't help yourself and it's. It's hard for you to have to struggle with what you want to do. It's nice that you want to help people with their problems. And this is something that I've had to learn. Because I've put others before myself a lot in my life. But... You do have to make sure you take care of yourself before trying to help others. And that doesn't mean you have to take care of yourself by yourself. That means just do what you can and get as much help as you feel you need. Oh jeez. I don't know how you do that U-turn. Like that. Like how, how. Oh gosh, my eye. So I prefer to hang in places where you're welcome. I get that. I 100% get that. I couldn't... There's a couple streams that I actually really enjoyed. And I'm not going to call out anybody's names because... That's not something you should do either. But I enjoyed hanging out with a couple streams, but somebody in chat was always a butt to everybody. Or the streamer actually was a butt. Turned out to be a butt, and I was just like, oh. I do not want to be here. And I just stopped going to those places. Because, I mean, it, it didn't make me feel welcome. I don't even think I said anything to them about it. I think I just, like, left. Because it's like, it's not my stream. I can't say anything to them about how they're acting or how my chat stacking towards others. So I was just like, I'll leave. And I haven't gone back. Oh jeez. Wait, real, you got second? I expected first on this track. Because you do really well on this track, like, ridiculously well. There's no, like, if ands, or buts about that. You agree? You're like that? If you don't feel welcome, you don't bother going back. We all know Tina hangs around like a wonderful smell. Yeah, I changed it. I changed what you said, because you don't hang around like a bad smell. You're not good at this track, it's probably one of your... Wait, I thought yesterday you said it was one of your better tracks, or you... No, wait. You, you said you were good at the U-turn section. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, real. My short-term memory is bad, like I said. 
You said you didn't like the beginning or the end, you just like that one section. I'm really sorry about that. Tina, you're not a bad smell. That sounds so weird to say out loud. The beginning and the end isn't good for you, but yeah, that one section. I just see you do that one section and I'm like, hell, you're so good at this track. The cell swords? Who's selling swords? No, seriously, he's doing that. Also, it's that time of night. I've been streaming for a little bit, my son is like, hey, buddy. How you feeling? You want some foods? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I would actually. Why am I like this? Okay, well, maybe you're not. Just maybe mind. Tina, if you hang around, if you hang around like a bad smell, we wouldn't want you. We wouldn't want you around. But we always want you around. So you can't be a bad smell. Uh, if you want to, you're just cramping and stuff. Oh crap, I ran to the wall. Did not turn soon enough. But I'm sorry. <laughs> Apparently, I had better boosties than the people behind me, I think. Come on. Come on. No, I lost it. Eat some spicy ramen. Be right back. I hope you have fun doing the things that you're doing. I wouldn't mind some ramen right now. Yeah. Nothing has been spicy to me though since uh, I was a little kid at my mom's apartment. And somebody that she knew from work made me some spicy food. Apparently everything she made was spicy. Not just in that meal, but just like in general. And, uh, well... It was so spicy that I was crying while I was eating it. And I wouldn't stop eating it because it was so good. Ever since then, though, anytime somebody's been like, this is spicy, I've eaten it, it's been like, I can't even taste the spice. It might have gotten rid of... It might have gotten rid of the, uh, the thingies. I know a very scientific name. This, 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 I can't even remember what it's called now. I can't even tell the spice now. I think that's what it is. I'll get the words out one day. Jeez, real. How you do? Ah, heck. Taste buds. I don't even know if that was what I was looking for, but maybe. I can't even think straight anymore. How does the brain work? Please, somebody let me know. I hear something behind me right now. I think it's Luna doing Luna things. Maybe? 
but I'm not sure. Luna, come here, baby. You want to come here? Come here, Luna. You want some belly rubs? You want some head pats? Can we rub your side? She's too lazy to come over here. <laughs> Can't believe she would do this to me. Oxide Station, that would get destroyed. Also, I will say, today will be a bit shorter than normal. As soon as the uh, bonus coins time is run out, we'll be whenever we call it for today. It'll probably be the same way tomorrow, too. So, honestly, we'll probably get like an hour and a half. These next two days. I think. Unless something happens. The spicy story reminded you of the first time you had. You tried ginger and wasabi. It was the first time you had sushi. Which now is one of your favorite foods. Your 15th birthday, your uncle came over and brought sushi and wanted to eat it with some wasabi and ginger. And when you took a bite, you tried your best not to spit it out. It really hurt your mouth, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that happened to you, but I'm glad you enjoyed sushi. I've only had sushi like twice in my life, and both times it's been really good. Also, I wish we had enough for these. But, 12,000 more total for that. I really enjoy sushi. I want some in my life again. There's a new sushi place near me and I need to go check it out. Eww. keep forgetting that these are all down here. Soon. Soon. These will all be like shown at the same time that are locked. Okay, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight rows, not even full eight rows, but still eight rows. Let's see. Uh, I kind of want to go Poppy Pyramid. I have a grocery store near you that has a little area for bento sushi and it's the best. Nice. My sister had said that she wants to take me out to lunch one day since we don't ever really see each other. Sometime in this month and I'm wondering if we might just go to the sushi place. We might but I'm not sure. I'm not saying the name because if it is local, it's like really close. And I don't want to be like, oh hey, this is where I live. Because that spooks me a little bit. What? Just saw something. You love to try other places that make sushi? You never gotten the chance though? The only times I've actually had sushi, actually no, I've said two times, I've had it three times in my life. I ate them at my mom's house when one of her boyfriends at the time, or her boyfriend at the time. I said one of her boyfriends because I'm so, I was so used to, when I was little, I'd go there like, once every six months and like it feel like every year she found somebody else but this one point in time she was dating this one guy that I saw once in my life and uh 
What was it? They they brought sushi home, and we all ate it. I was the only one that liked it. Then I remember coming home because I was like 13, 14 at the time. To be like, Dad, I had sushi. It was amazing. He's like, You're not eating that. That's just disgusting. And I was like, oh, okay. And since I, did, since I haven't really driven a lot and I don't have a job, it's like, I haven't really gone since. But whenever Aspect came over in January, we went to a buffet because there wasn't any place that was near me that was just like anything other than a buffet that served sushi. And we ate it again. I was like, oh my gosh, I forget how good this stuff was. And then, I had it like the last full day I was over there. She was like, we still need to go eat sushi because we talked about doing this before you came over. And I was like, I'm fine with this. I want some sushi. I want something good to eat before I get it. Your mom doesn't like it either. I'm sorry. The only person I know in my family that likes it besides me is my sister. And she was like, we can go eat sushi. And I was like, all right, I'm... I'm down. Just let me know whenever you're ready. <laughs> Which I don't know, it might be next week. Which if it is, I am ready. Chinese in a while either. Actually, that's a lie. I had it whenever, uh, I had it the night before Thanksgiving, so I lied to you. I'm sorry. I actually think I'm gonna drop out once we get enough for, uh, the other sticker pack, which should be another race after this. Wait, when did I get ahead of uh, Megumi? Your uncle loves sushi and he inspired you to try it for the first time? Nice. He also really likes wasabi and ginger. He's like it's just nothing and it's pretty crazy. I can imagine. I'm ready to eat sushi again. I really want to. To be fair, I get my car back soon. I want to get going for a job. I could go there every once in a while and just be like, ooh, nice sushi for me in my tum tum. Don't mind me. I'm literally losing my mind, apparently. Seriously, I'm gonna have to do that. I have. I remember whenever I was really little, whenever my mom and dad were still together, we used to go to this Chinese place every other month. Or every other week, not month, sorry. I loved eating there. The food was so good. I don't think uh, CTR has game chat. I really don't think it does. Does Crash Team Racing have game chat? You've had Chinese food since you were super young. You're around six or seven and you loved it ever since then? I have too.
I honestly don't know if this has game chat. I've honestly never heard game chat in here. We've always went to the same place, but that recently got shut down, so we got another place. I'm sorry you got shut down, but I'm glad you got another place. Also, uh, the place that my brother-in-law and my sister took me to, I didn't go inside. My brother-in-law just went and picked up food. While me and my sister sat in the guard, but uh... He had said that they go to this place so often that uh, they know his order. As soon as he walks in that door, they're like, okay, we know what you're getting. Which to me is kind of funny, honestly. But whatever they ordered, they said it was like really spicy. To be fair, my brother-in-law can't handle spicy food after what's gone on with him in his stomach. But, um... My sister's like, oh god, this is spicy. And I remember eating it and being like, I taste nothing. I taste no spice. So I did not want to run into him. Come on. Goodbye, Digital Land Trophy. I love spicy food too, but seriously, nothing tastes spicy to me since that one meal. I also really love other kinds of seafood besides sushi. Yeah, I do too. Seafood in general is really good. I haven't really had a lot of different kinds of seafood though. Because we don't eat seafood enough for me to be like, I want to experiment. Your taste buds have evolved. Honestly, if I, honestly, if I could only pick one type of meat, I'd pick seafood. Like, I know that sounds weird because that's like a still a huge group of food, but if it was either seafood or like I know these are also different, like chicken, cow, stuff like that, I'd go seafood. If I could go seafood or land food. <laughs> I go seafood. <laughs> Don't mind me. I don't even know what I'm talking about either. My dear Skyway, please and thank you. Ten more races. We're so far away from that. Clockwork Wampa, okay. We love oysters, like mussels. Noozles? I can't even words good. That's like shrimp and you recently tried calamari and squid. I've not had calamari, squid, or oysters. Also, those koala kongs are in sync. I don't know how to feel about this. Since your taste buds is being the spicy stuff, you should just eat a jar of cayenne pepper. Maybe. We'll see how that goes. I don't know if it's immune, but I think like the stuff that's spicy to the people around me isn't spicy to me. I really don't think... I, my, I don't think I'm immune to this. Spices. I'm sure I'd find something to be like, oh god, why? Your mom knows a lot about seafood since your dad knew a lot. Told you no matter what, how you cook squid will always be very chewy and tough, but it's still pretty good. I wouldn't mind trying it one day. 
We'll just have to wait and see what happens. I remember bringing that up to somebody in my family. They're like, oh no. Never. I ain't eating that. Let's go. President Prez. Whew. There's a Koala Kong at the start. I repeat, there's a Koala Kong at the start. Could somebody please press the gas for them? I meant to say please, but it came out as freeze. Did not want to lose that. What about Octopus? What do you mean, what about Octopus? Eek. Come on. Let me go the speedy speed. Watch, one day I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna stream myself cooking something. And just be like, how does one start the oven? No! Eee. second place just hit the guy that's not moving. Did you see that? I was sitting here watching the map. No, I have not tried it, sorry. I think we can do it. Probably not tonight, but I think we can get nine more wins. I do wonder exactly how much we'll get done by tomorrow for the uh, stickers. Because The new event's coming up soon. It might be a good idea to save up a little bit for the new event. At least I feel like it would be. Also, I'm super excited for the Game Awards. I'm hoping they announce the Crash game, the new one. Please. I want to see it. I want to see what Vicarious Visions will do with a new Crash game. I really do. I won't be doing everything again when I get the PS4. Or the Switch version. I'll, uh, I'll just... The only things that I'm going to have to do... For 100% type stuff since I've already done everything on the since I'll have already done everything on the Xbox most likely is just do the stuff with the bonus track and the retro skins and costumes I don't know if I'd go for literally every single item again though the new Spongebob game the uh, battle for bikini bottom rehydrated or is there another one I'm gonna pick that game up I don't know when it comes out, but I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to stream it at some point. 
Oh, okay, so it is that one. Does, do we even know when that comes out? I've never played it before, but I'd love to. SpongeBob SquarePants. Rehydrated? Yeah. Back. Welcome back. Sometime next year. I'm hoping to get it around the time it comes out. We'll see. Call him, please. Oh, heck, I was trying to get the scroll so I could try to see if it said anything. It would be nice if they had like a release date. Get him on. I do that like once in a while and it's not good. That hurts me so much. No. Rude. The rudest of the rude. Thank you for hitting that item box for me. The Spongebob game, you hope it's like Spongebob Super Sponge, the PS1. That one is really good with an awesome soundtrack. It is Battle for Bikini Bottom. It was originally released on the GameCube, original Xbox, and PS2. Back in 2001 or two, I want to say? And people absolutely love that game. I never played it before though. I would love to. And uh, yeah, I'll, I will definitely play the rehydrated version of it. Whenever that comes out. Whenever that may be. Get him on. Oh heck, I lost it. You want the 2D one? I mean, maybe one day. I don't know. No! Rude! The rudest rude that I ever did see. Come on. I may not get first, but dang it, I'm going to get second. Eesh. No work word. No. No. Whew. Let's see. I wish it was, I wish there was like a release quarter for it. It was just 2020. Either way, I'm excited for it. I'll probably pick it up around the time it comes out. I know I'm going to pick up uh, the new Crash game whenever it gets announced. Because I want it. I need it, Lucky. I don't need it, but I do want it. At this point, you honestly believe you'll get your wish. We got DMC 5, Kingdom Hearts 3, Shinry 3, Resident Evil 2 and 3 remake. So you think it'll like come eventually? I mean, maybe. As soon as I get a PS4, I'm picking up Shinry 3. 
I want to play that game. I want to experience Shinji 3. I still need to play DMC 5. I still need to play DMC 1 and 2 as well. I know 2 is one people don't like, but I still like to play it just to see what it's like. And I still need to play Kingdom Hearts 3. I'll probably pick up Kingdom Hearts 3 whenever the collections of the rest of the games come to the Xbox. Which was actually announced last month, I think? Sometime in November? Whenever Xbox's event was? But yeah, the entirety of Kingdom Hearts is coming to Xbox. And I am happy about it. I want it. I will be streaming Kingdom Hearts whenever that comes out. It's going to be so good. I need to get Joey to sing over the intro for me. Like he did on his stream. If he would be willing to do that for me. No, Shinri 3 is PlayStation 4 only. It might be on PC as well, but it's not on any other consoles. If Shinri 3 is on the Xbox, I would have already streamed it. Or been streaming it. Really? That's because they're running away from you, they know how good you are? And they don't want to race you. Because they know they're going to lose. Eesh. Heck. And yes, I do say these things because I do honestly believe you're that good. Even if you don't agree with that. Eesh. Do Kingdom Hearts on proud difficulty. I mean, if there's achievements for it, I'm gonna have to. Because I'm gonna go for all the achievements. I've only played Kingdom Hearts 1, Chain of Memories, and 2. So I'm like really far behind on the Kingdom Hearts series. There's just so many things you had to own to play all the games. I mean, now it's just like, hey, you can play all of them on one system, or at least play and watch them. I know a few of them you just have to watch, right? On the collections. Oh, thank you. I'll watch Keen Watch on crowd mode. Oh, there's a lot of just traps on that. Come on. No, they left my game. First place is rough there, you get a PS4. You're the king on that platform. Heck. I'm not on I'm not even in first now. I I'm also wanting to know you leave my first place days. Oh wait, I didn't realize that you said you said that too real. I just like looked down and saw the comment, I was like, I gotta read this. Real I believe in you. Also, like I said. It'll be a bit shorter today and it'll probably be a bit shorter tomorrow. We're gonna go and buy our last item for the day. Or, yeah, our last item, because we won't have enough for two. Unless there's a really cheap one in the store. You finished Kingdom Hearts 3 on proud mode? Legit the easiest hard mode you've ever beaten? That doesn't sound good, because if it's hard, I want it to be a challenge. I want to say that number one of them will be so hard I can't handle it. 
some dude won. Well, we're gonna be able to get another one of these tomorrow. Or not, because I want to go ahead and buy this. Really? I wonder why that is. But, uh... I know we're ending a bit earlier than we usually do. But... But... I, I think Tomato has seen that in the races. <laughs> well, I'll say thank you all for stopping by, lurking and chatting. I hope you all have a wonderful day and a wonderful night. And I can't wait to see you all again very soon. We'll be back tomorrow night for more CTR. Good night, everybody. I love you all.